central issue of any system, who owns the capital, who owns wealth. If it's not concentrated in the top 1% or the top 400, a democratized system ultimately requires laying down foundations that democratize the ownership of wealth and capital. Now, one way to think about this, and I'm going to talk about several things that are emerging on the ground, but one way to think about this is most of the big national programs that became the New Deal were actually based on programs that started in communities and states in the 20 years before the New Deal. 